Life is a struggle, Ashley. There are good days, there are bad days. Bad years, bad decades, what do you mean? You obsess with my life. Get over me. Karen, you talk such a big game, girl. Girl, ain't nobody talking no game. Give you a few bottles of champagne and you act like you're Beyonce. Beyonce. Oh, okay? you know what? Listen, it's, it's all good, Ashley. We're done. We're done, baby. But you may be like an old book I saw yesterday. Like, Bye. you know, a broke version of Tina Knowles. Oh, jeez. Woo, this is getting good. Oh, you would know broke. Your husband not only kicked your ass out, he moved you a mile down the street from your sweat box and put your ass in the studio. Karen, do you really want to go there, Karen? I your husband talked to my husband, and you don't want to know what he said. Oh, no, let me tell you, I did talk to my husband. And so I called him and told him what you told me. And Ray says, I'm ready to semi-retire. He is. He's going to be 71. He says, I'm looking for a place here and a place that you got the Florida part right. You just found that out last night? No, no, baby. I knew it all along. I wanted to hear it from my husband, because she said he said he wanted to leave me. No, he said he's going to Florida with or without you. No, definitely. Meaning you weren't an integral part of the equation. No, that's not what he said. He just didn't want to hurt your feelings. I believe he Ray all day over Michael and you. But Ray shouldn't believe Trust you. and believe. You take your fake marriage and ram it up your ass, OK? Your husband always crying when he's around you. You make him miserable. I leave my institution alone. It's well established. Karen, you're a blatant liar. What you do is you sneak into situations, get close, so you can get some information and go put a fake oh, news spin on it. I'm done of, with your ass, there OK? There are a lot of things about oh, you that I haven't I'm still standing. You, where you, you at? I hope you continue I, to. I, I will, boo-boo.